All right guys, Turtle here, and it is finally time. We have managed to get our hands on some Rebel Clash, and uh, I could not find this for the for anything. Reached out to the league I go to, as many professors I could reach, LGSs, and couldn't pick up any. And uh, But a generous fan of a name, any, anyone that joins us on our Twitch streams might recognize, might know, Mr. Garfield has hooked us up with a battle B&B box, as well as three packs. Thank you so much, Garfield. So incredibly generous of you. And finally, we're going to get open into these. All right, so what are we looking for? The, it seems like the big card is a boss's orders. The big boss, especially that full art variety. And then tons of cool VMAXs. Here people talking about the Dragapult, the, the Bolton. All right, this is the the promo, I think these promos are kind of pretty underwhelming, especially compared to the Sword and Shield. Uh, Toxicity sounds cool. The one I want is Rillaboom. I think that'd be really fun to play. But, and we'll get into this at the end. Maybe there's some cool supporters in there. Maybe you can find even a boss's order. But uh, yeah, if you are, if you do play the online game, you're interested in codes, definitely just attend our Twitch streams. We do giveaways throughout the streams and as soon as we can trade these, ooh, horror energy, I do like this, uh, provides a psychic energy, if you attach to a psychic Pokemon, basically you have ability where uh, if you get attacked, you put two damage counters on the attacking Pokemon, kind of cool. Actually, we should take a look at some of these, Galarian Darumaka, Flip Coin, Flip Paralyze, and eh. Scyther. But yeah, we'll be doing those throughout the streams as soon as we can, we got Mr. Sir fetched. Um, as twitch.com slash I want a turtle we stream Monday Tuesday and Thursday evenings at 7 p.m. EST discard up to two cards in your hand then draw two cards for each card discarded that way hmm that's kind of cool and then meteor assault 180 this Pokemon can't use meteor assault again until it leaves the active spot okay that's that doesn't sound too difficult to pull off interesting card right there let me see put a pause like this for now But uh, yeah, I was really looking forward to this set. I think it'll be interesting to see, you know, with everything going on, uh, kind of like how this set will be received. It wouldn't surprise me if overall there's less kind of stuff opened and kind of like how that will affect things. All right, we got a Natu and then a Bomb of Snow. Nothing too interesting here. Your opponent's active Pokemon is asleep. Ooh, the Intellion VMAX sounds kind of cool as well. I really hope this set really shakes up the meta. Uh, based on the Limitless TCG tournament that's going on, uh, things seem to be selling <laughs> Capacious Bucket. I think in Japanese it was called Bucket of Water or something? Water Bucket? Capacious Bucket. Uh, maybe this is what Frostmoth needs to get those energy to accelerate. Another Horror Energy, nice. And then a Palpitoad. But yeah, the meta seems to be settling on some ADPZ and a mill with the occasional Reshizard list. Ooh. And uh, not as much variety as I would have hoped. Let's see, we got it. We got Eskew, Ice Face. If this Pokemon's full HP, take 60 damage from your opponent's attacks. Take 60 damage from your opponent's attacks. Okay, so I guess that means it can't get knocked out if it has full HP. You can't one-shot it, I guess. Blizzard 70, this attack does 10 damage to each of your opponent's bench Pokemon. Hmm. Not sure about that. All right, hopefully we get at least one hit. And I just want to thank every one of my subs on this channel. We are getting close to that 1,000 sub mark. And once this thing kind of comes out in its full, uh, we'll probably do some giveaways. And as well as I do want to do a special giveaway when we do hit that 1,000 sub mark. So thank you to everyone, especially those that have been with the channel for a really long time. Let's see, we got Galar Mine. Retreat cost of both active Pokemon is two more. Oh my. You know, we uh, remember like some Tangro stuff with Absol. Maybe that could come back. Durant. So what does Durant do? For each energy attack, so you search your deck for a trainer card, reveal it, and then put it into... Whoa. That's kind of cool. Gathering food. Hmm, you know, we'll put that off to the side. This could be... Could be pretty useful. And here's the Farfetch. Nothing too impressive. 
but Surf Fetch can deal quite a bit of damage. All right, we're about past the halfway mark. We got three. These are the three additional packs. So I think, unless I didn't read that correctly, uh, the packs inside the BNB box didn't really come through, but no worries. We got three extra ones. Once again, guys, huge shout out to Garfield. Thank you so much. Uh, fire Pokemon attached to this active spot is damaged by an opponent's attack. The attacker is now burned. Hmm. We'll put that off the side, but that doesn't sound that impressive. Dreepy, that's a funny name. Quick attack, 10 more damage, Snover, Binacle. One thing I'll say, I, so far I feel like none of the arts, a lot of the art is not too impressive. And okay, at least we did get one V card. We did get a Nine Tails V. Let's see, we got Nine Tails. I think this is the one without the V Max, right? Nine Tails Shift Shift to choose one of your opponent's active Pokemon's attack and use it as this attack. You, you know, one interesting, it doesn't say anything about GX attack. So I'm wondering what the ruling is there. Can you use the GX attack and is it only if you haven't GX'd yet? Flamethrower for 1A discard, only one energy, not too bad. Interesting card, we still have a Welder. So, you know, turn one uh, Brave Blade to take out a Zacian, not too bad. Or even uh, like against ADP just to get that ramp up with Ultimate Ray. All right, I, I'm actually kind of excited about this. Could be fun to try that out. All right, so we did get we didn't get shut out, which is awesome. And so we are hoping to do some openings. All right, this is the one I'm excited about: special lightning energy, or speed energy, uh, provides lightning. And if you attach this to a electric Pokemon, draw two cards. Just a free two draw. Yes, it's a special energy, so maybe it's more vulnerable but gives you the energy and draw two, that's incredible. Compared to what, like that, that draw energy, which was colorless and you just draw one card, Toxel. Lotag, Cleaf Fairy, Palpitoad, and then a Bur Burrascuta. What does this guy do? Discard two energies from your hand. If you don't, this attack does nothing. Okay, so do we have a situation where we want to get water energy into the discard? Hmm. All right, guys, last pack, and then we'll go get into this, see if there's any cool supporters in there. And uh, yeah, in case you're not familiar with Garfield, uh, we do have a thanks emote um, for the Twitch streams, and that is, uh, what's the word? Inspired by Garfield and his generosity. So huge shout out to Garfield. All right, we do got the new Oleana. Let's see, you can play this card only if you discard two other cards from your hand. Your opponent reveals their hand. Put a trainer card you find there and put it on the bottom of their deck. Hmm, that could be super annoying against I don't know, some kind of controllers. I could see that. Uh, we'll see. And the last one is a Butterfree with Panic Poison. Uh, burn, Confuse, and Poison for one energy. Not, not too bad. I'll put this off down here. And so we did get one hit. The Nine Tails V. This card sounds very interesting. It was something I want to try. And lastly, let's get into this just to see if there's any cool supporters. But yeah, if you do, are you looking for code? Just try to attend one of our Twitch streams. And once we can start giving away these, we will. All right, so we got that Flapple. Once your turn, you may put two damage counters on one of your opponent's Pokemon. That's pretty cool. If placed damage counters this way, this shuffle this Pokemon and all the cards attach it back to, into your deck. So you kind of have to just keep cycling them for that Apple Drop. And you can do 60 damage, discard an energy. Ooh, discard an energy from your opponent's active Pokemon. That's not too bad either. So put this over here. All right, then we'll just kind of, ooh, I do like this one. Uh, once your turn, you may search your deck for a Grass Evolution. So I'm wondering if we could use this, like I do want to play Rillaboom, whether you could use Turf Field, you could use the row eggs to get the evolutions off. We'll put, keep that one off. Milo, we saw, and Dan, draw two cards. Your opponent play Rock type, Rock, you and your opponent play rock, paper, scissors. Oh my. <laughs> okay. Do we need like official rules for rock, paper, scissors now? That's. Ooh, okay. Speed energy. I like it. Got some Shanks, Luxio, and then a Luxray. Headbolt 120, raid 60 plus. This attack. If this Pokemon evolved from Luxio this turn. Okay. That's, that's pretty cool. It is a stage two though. And it has to evolve from specific Luxio, so you can't rare candy that. 
All right, so it looks like we got some cool stuff in that speed energy and the turf field. But yeah, that's going to be it for today. Um, Garfield, thank you so much. Really appreciate that. And uh, yeah, if you guys did enjoy the video, please drop a like and subscribe. We're getting close to that 1,000. I'm Moana Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time.